I'm Tara Maxwell. Today I'm going to demonstrate how to tie a double Windsor knot in your necktie. The only thing I'm going to use is a necktie and my husband for demonstrations. I'm going to start off by asking a couple questions like, who here wears a, a necktie every day on an everyday basis? Work. Work. Um, who taught y'all how, who, who how to tie a necktie? Um, I actually taught myself. Uh, I would have to wear a tie to work, but it was usually just a couple of days a month. Uh, so I would forget, so we kind of get frustrated. Uh, but the more I, I wore a tie now currently for work, uh, it's a lot easier. Because you remember what your the motions and what you're doing actually not. My grandpa and Google. Did you guys find it hard to learn how to tie a necktie? Did you um, find it hard to, like... Yeah, first it was first. difficult. Because I, 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 would, I would not remember what I was doing because it was only a few times a month. But uh, now I'm, I'm where I have to wear a tie pretty much a few days a week. So it's, uh, it's a lot easier uh, to, to tie the tie. At first it's always hard and then it gets a little easier as time goes by. and Practice makes perfect. Okay. Matt, I'm going to have you come up and I'm going to actually demonstrate the tie on you. So can you come up? First thing you're going to do is make sure the collar is up on your shirt so you have your workspace clear. Then you're going to place the tie around your neck and make sure it's straight. You want to make sure that the tail is about at your third button. You're going to hold the short end in your left hand, the long wide end in your right hand. You're going to cross the wide end over the short end, so now it's in your left hand. You're going to take the long end, the wide end, and you're going to pull it through the whole, the neck, the ring, uh, the loop in your neck. You're going to make sure that you're holding this tight and flat and everything is flush so that you can have a nice knot. And you're going to take that still in your left hand, the wide part, you're going to take it around the back, like so. And you're going to have it in your right hand now, the long, the long side, the wide side. Still making sure that you're holding everything nice and level, straight. And you're going to take this long side, the wide side, and you're going to pass it through this way, through the loop, like this. And you're going to come up with this sort of little knot here. That's how you know you got something going there. You got this nifty little knot. This is in your right hand still. You're going to take this and you're going to pass it over the front. We're going to make like a cover for the knot. So now it's in your left hand. Making sure you still keep it tight. It's very important to have it tight. You're going to pass this through this loop, through the back. See? Pull it through. Then you're going to take this, this long wide tail, and you're going to pass it through this little pocket here. Remember, make sure it's really tight. It's very important to be tight. Otherwise, your necktie won't tighten correctly. When you're tightening it, go ahead and make sure it's all flat. Everything is straight. Tight. And you can put the collar down. When putting the collar down, you can see that the that it's symmetrical. Okay. The when the tie is cut tied correctly, um, it is symmetrical. Like I already said, it's comfortable to wear. It's not too tight, right? Not too tight. It's well balanced. Uh, the length is really good, so that means this tie fits really good. Um, the largeness in the knot allows for the fabric to, and pattern to be more visible and show better, especially when you're wearing a jacket or a closed coat. Um, this tie is made or made to look better on gentlemen that are have a uh, round or a strong square face. Also then the knot is self-releasing which is also pretty interesting about this knot. All you have to do is pull up on this short end of the tie and it comes off really easy. Um, that's my demonstration of how to tie a 